Hello everybody. Now this video will show you how to have one complete firmware backup from the latest Western Digital hard drives with PCB number eight zero 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 six five or eight zero 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 six seven or eight one zero 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 three. So these three types of PCB number have the same family name. It's called this is a family name for these three mentioned PCB numbers. Now let's check how to back up the firmware modules. First, we need to back up the ROM. Okay, now we just simply click ROM backup, then we can see ROM read OK. We can go to the firmware directory and confirm. Then we, we can find we have backup the ROM here successfully. Next, let's back up the firmware modules, read modules, and we back up the modules here. Now we can see that the DFLWD firmware repair program can back up all these firmware modules at high speed. But sometimes, in order to make sure all the firmware modules have been backed up successfully, we need to back up the SA. Read SA. This is SA copy zero. So we just need to back up the SA arrow as one whole file. So this makes sure no missing modules. Because sometimes with the standard firmware module backup method, the module names for the new drives, they may have been changed. So if we just back up from modules, sometimes the module may not be completed. So users are suggested to back up the SA arrow. So this will make sure all the firmware modules will be back up successfully. We go to check the log window and we will find the backup result. The essay backup completes and users can see that the firmware error has been backed up by ABM mode. So this is how we can back up the whole SA error. Thank you for watching this video.